After watching that super close finish at the most recent race here in Atlanta, that got me thinking. What were some of the closest finishes in NASCAR history? I was pretty amazed by that most recent finish, and it's not too often that you see something like that. So I figured I'd make a little bit of a list here and take a deep dive down through it. But starting off the list in number 10 is the 2020 Geico 500 at Talladega Super Speedway between Ryan Blaney and Ricky Stenhouse Jr. Blaney pokes out, Stenhouse is with him. Harvick got away from Busher. Oh, but up front, they're racing for the win. Blaney's McBrash ahead. is in the back, and Blaney is the leader. Stenhouse comes back to him on the bottom. Off turn four, three wide. Not over yet. Here comes Eric Jones. Nemechek trying to push Jones. Eric Jones with help. Here comes Almirola. Crash into the wall. I think it's Stenhouse. It might be Blaney. Oh, my goodness. They were, what, three, four wide? Slamming and banging. More contact. Man, Stenhouse was so close to... What a wild finish. Ryan Blaney makes the list twice in a row, and he'll have a different Ryan that he'll be going up against this time. He has to get another run, but Newman way out front. They're going to have a big run coming up on this six car down the front straightaway. Huge block coming right here. Blaney, as they go around the 37, almost upside down. So is the 96, Parker Kligerman. Here they come. They make contact. They're side by side. It's a photo finish at the line. Blaney, by just a foot, is going to get the win over Newman. Coming up next, we've got Kevin Harvick and Jimmy Johnson battling it out at the duels down at Daytona. Don't count Jimmy Johnson Jimmy out. Johnson's Ooh. fighting back. It's going to be a drive. Not over yet. Check Who is going to be? Jimmy Johnson. Johnson got it. I mean. By inch. Six one thousandths of a second. That's what I said, an inch. With the, uh, he made it. Wow. What great camera work. What a finish. Right there. There's the that. difference. Instead of Harvick by inches, it's Johnson by inches. The next race features a young Kevin Harvick and Jeff Gordon. By the way, there might be a video coming up about Kevin Harvick. Subscribe to see that soon. Get up off your seat. Here Gordon they go. For two in a row, trying to set him up. Gordon's going to make the big move on the inside when they get down here to turn three. Awesome. Slow car might be in the way. Here he comes. He's going to drive it to the bottom. Oh, Harvick's leaving a lot of bottom open. Oh, this slow car, slow car, slow car's going to be in the way. Just That's like a year ago, he's going to get him, though. Here he's going to get him. Gordon got loose. It's Harvick. Harvick by goes. inches. Harvick by inches. Harvick by inches. What a race. How, what a finish. How did Jeff Gordon hang on to that car? That loose off turn four. This. Man. For the win. That is ever so six one thousandths of a second. A replay of a year ago with Dale Earnhardt and Bobby Labonte. The next race takes us down to a duel down at Daytona for a finish between Clint Boyer and Jeff Burton. They're going to take a look here, Michael and, and Kyle. Here they come. They got to run, but they're going to crash. Oh, no. Trevor Bain uh, is in it along with David Reagan. Yeah. And Burton will win it Those over break. Boyer. Five one thousandths of a second. The next race is a super close finish between Jamie McMurray and Kyle Busch down at Daytona International Speedway. Uh, I, don't, I don't know if he'll be able to make the move for the win. Kyle Busch is the guy right here. He's yep, the he's going he's to have the momentum and he's going to get to the line. Coming to the checkers. Oh, wow. Oh, that was close. I don't know. I Waiting for scoring. I think the 26 got him. It says 26 on the monitor. But wow. Great. That's incredible. Watch the 26 just get a surge right before the line. It's his teammate right behind him, Carl Edwards. Right there, the five had the advantage. And he had the momentum. And here they are. And you see. Now watch, right here. Right there. You see it start to move again. Remember the finish in the 500? <laughs> How about that? That is That's good stuff. That's incredible. The next race takes us back to 1993 for a finish between the Intimidator and Ernie Irvin. Here they come. Irvin on the inside. The shortcut on the inside is going to be of some help. 
as they come to the line, dead even. I don't know. I think Looks like the three. I think Earnhardt won the race. Because off the close. Or does this tell Digger that we do this every time we race up here? <laughs> Isn't that something? Unbelievable to run the kind of race that's been here today and finish it with a few inches. Give it to Earnhardt. Dale Earnhardt has done it again. Look at this finish. Look at the four wide on the back right behind him. The next one on our list is the 2001 Gatorade Duel number two between Dale Earnhardt Jr. and Mike Skinner. By the way, if you're more interested in this whole race weekend, I made a whole video breaking this whole thing down. You should give it a look. Skinner blocking Jr. Oh, gee. Uh oh, boys. He's going to run out of racetrack. Got to give him some room, Mike. Earnhardt Jr. muscled his way to the front. They're lining up for a run behind him. Here comes Jeff Burt. This is it. They all make it back without wrecking him. Surprise me, boys. Two by two. Earnhardt on the bottom. Skinner up top to squeeze him down. Photo for that finish. I will not try to call that. We was looking right down on him. Here they come. Want to be on the outside, right? Just a, oh, just a look back here. We still got another one back here. There's that's just as close. That's rusty and more. Here's, Here's another one. There's close. another one. <laughs> There's another one. <laughs> Next up on the list is the race that inspired the idea for this video the 2024 and Better Health 400 down in Atlanta between Daniel Suarez and Ryan Blaney. Man, this Ryan Blaney guy really has a thing for these close finishes. Where does he block? Does he block high? Does he block yep. low? Here it comes. Kyle Busch to the middle. Shooting a gap. No help with Kyle Busch. Oh, Suarez right alongside him. Three wide. Off Look turn at this. Four. Here they come to the flag. Three abreast. Photo finish. How about, I think it's Blaney. Unbelievable. Three wide finish. Have you ever seen anything like that? Scoring. Finish is under review. Scoring has the margin between the first three cars at 0, 0.00 seconds. <laughs> How awesome was that? How about that? Freeze frame, stop motion to the line. That's too close to call. <laughs> Unbelievable. 99 to all the meat. Race clear is the 99. How the about 99. that? In the penultimate spot, we've got the 2011 Aaron's 499 at Talladega Super Speedway between Jimmy Johnson and Clint Boyer. All bets are off. They get to the middle of the trial. Watch out, down low. Way Good down run. comes Johnson. Good run. He's got room. They're three wide. Three by three to the line. Johnson. Maybe Jimmy Johnson. I believe he got him by an inch. Two one thousandths of a second he beat Boyer. Okay, a sixteenth of an inch. Have you ever? Oh, man. <laughs> oh, man. No, we have I never, have never seen boy. anything like that. No. Woo Left just enough room on the inside for Johnson and Earnhardt. Right there in the tri-oval, it's Boyer's race. Yeah, it looks like Boyer's pulling ahead, but then all of a sudden they hit that air, that wall of air. Here comes that 48. But Darrell, the start finish line here is a thousand feet further. And look how close it is. Four wide at the wire. That is just a beautiful thing right there. Two, four, six, eight cars. So close, we can hardly capture it with our stop motion camera. There's a look at it, and there is the margin. And last, but certainly not least, is this beautiful finish between Ricky Craven and Kurt Busch at Darlington. By the way, Darlington. We didn't mention that track at all yet. They're driving good. Half a mile. Here he comes. Here he comes. Who's going to get off? Here he comes. Here he comes. He's got him this time. It's going to be a drag race. Wow. They touch. They touch. Craven got him. Craven got him. Craven got him. Craven. All right. What a finish. Have you ever? No, I've never. Wow. What a finish. So yeah, guys, that's going to do it for this video here. If you like this stuff, drop a like or a subscribe. It helps out a lot. And if you want to watch some long-form video stuff, I made a couple mini documentaries. They're pretty cool. You should give them a check, too. That'll do it for this video.